the Delhi government is set to ban app-based taxis from other states. Will this ban help fight Delhi's pollution or will it be an added trouble for the Aam Aadmi? As Delhi faces peak pollution levels amid increasing farm fires and unfavorable weather conditions, the AAP government is taking various steps to tackle the issue. But the question is, will the steps help in giving a respite to Delhiites or will they just add to the burden of the common people? The ban is among a series of steps announced by the AAP government, including the odd even scheme for private cars and ban on diesel trucks from neighboring states. The proposed ban on app-based taxis from other states is being seen as controversial because it will directly impact the availability of public transport. On the other hand, steps like odd-even can be successful only when there is more public transport on the road, not less. Critics point out that the ban on app-based taxis from neighboring states will in fact increase people's dependence on private cars which will in turn increase pollution and not decrease it. On its part, the Delhi government says that it will increase the frequency of buses and other modes of public transport. No, in Delhi, the Supreme Court has given the directions to the Supreme Court. If you are going to be able to do this, and you are not going to be able to do this, then there will be a lot of difficulty. Public transport is the purpose of the public transport. The frequency will increase, the frequency will increase, the capacity will increase, the metro will increase. इससे ज़्यादा से ज़्यादा लोग उसको पब्लिक ट्रांसपोर्ट को यूज़ करें आउट इवन को लेकर के जो 13 से 20 तक का लागू करने का निर्णय जो फैसला हुआ है उसमें जो सुप्रीम कोर्ट ने ऑब्जर्वेशन दिया उसमें हम उसकी जो स्टडी रिपोर्ट है और उन्होंने जो दिया है उस सारी जो रिपोर्ट है वो कोर्ट में सबमिट करेंगे अगली सुनवाई पर और कोर्ट जो फैसला करेगा उसके अनुसार फिर हम आगे बढ़ें Ironically, most cabs that will go off roads due to this ban are run on CNG, which is an environment-friendly fuel. Residents and cab aggregators fear multiple hits and see a chaotic week ahead if the decision is implemented because a large chunk of cars that ply for aggregators like Uber, Ola and InDrive have UP and Haryana number plates, registered mostly in Gurgaon, Noida or Ghaziabad. A transport industry source said more than 1 lakh cabs fly daily across Delhi and CR and if those with UP and HR registration numbers are barred from entering the capital during odd even, about 60-70% to 70 of these cars would be affected. People going to offices or the airport then may have to depend upon personal cars for the journey. Fewer cabs on the roads will also result in higher fares and will be an added problem for residents. People from Noida, Gurugram and Ghaziabad who want to go to the airport or the railway station will also be affected. Cab owners and drivers also say their earnings will also be hit because of the ban. A Times online report. Stay with the Times of India for news breaks, analysis, interviews and events. We bring you stories from your neighbourhood and from across the globe as well. Subscribe to our YouTube channel. Hit the like button and press the bell icon so you don't miss any of our videos.